You're watching CNA Heroes. Here's Lisa Sweet. Hello, and welcome to CNA Heroes. I'm Lisa Sweet, the co-founder of the National Association of Healthcare Assistants. Today is Friday, March 13th, 2020, and this week's CNA Heroes segment is a bit different than they've been in the past. Today, I want to honor those who leave their families at home to go to work to care for our families when they're at their sickest. I want to recognize the 1.5 million women and men who go to work as CNAs and ALCs, assisted living caregivers, at our nation's skilled nursing facilities, nursing homes, hospitals, and assisted living centers, and those who go into people's homes to provide important home health care and hospice care. COVID-19, the coronavirus that is sweeping the globe, has made its way to our nation, to our homes, to our front doors. Today, there are over 1 million CNAs and ALCs who are suited up and ready to serve as we fight a war against a deadly virus that has come to threaten those we care for. CNAs are sacrificing sleep, time with family, and potentially their own health during what many consider a frightening time. Often CNAs are working shorthanded, sometimes without the equipment and the resources they need, and for a paycheck that definitely does not reflect their value. They do so out of love and commitment. CNAs, assisted living caregivers, please know that you do not go unnoticed. You are so important. Take care of yourself during these demanding times. Be there for each other and support each other so you can compassionately serve and care for those who need you so desperately. Today, I would like everyone to join me in recognizing and thanking those working so hard behind the masks, CNAs and ALCs, this week's Heroes. <laughs> 